Hi, this is Brandon Block with America.gov. We're here today on the National Mall taking a look at the 20 teams competing to build the home of the future in the Solar Decathlon. Today we're going to take a look at the team from Alberta, Canada. We're Team Soul Abode from Calgary, Alberta in Canada. The house is something that the team, since day one, really wanted to represent Western Canada. For us, we believe that the architecture should reflect the place from which it comes. To use local materials as much as we could, uh, so Douglas fir, uh, the Rundle stone core, a barn wood right out of Cochrane, Alberta. The barn wood was taken down by a group of students, and so we recycled it and used it on the home. That natural feature, more of a cabin feature, sort of that Rocky Mountain aesthetic is something that I think is unique to Canada as well. This project has been fantastic. To build your own home, to build your own design, teaches you more about design and new technologies and integrating technologies than the classroom ever could. I think it's critical for students to learn this stuff because this is not a trend, this is the wave of the future. I'm an architectural researcher now, so I've taken projects like this and it's actually given me a job basically designing new innovative technologies and I'm building solar houses for a living now. And it's only been six months since graduation. Uh, it's been fantastic. I'm inspired. All the projects here are gorgeous. The Europeans are bringing a new design aesthetic. The Canadians are bringing sort of a, a home kind of rustic feel. The Americans are bringing new technology and a real patriotism. And bringing all of those things together to showcase innovation, innovative design and new technologies, this is the only forum and opportunity for that. It's really telling the public, here's where we are, here's where we can be, this is what can be done and inspiring them. 